Hi, this is Angela Murata at Amazing Kids AAC Consulting. I wanted to give you a quick look at some things that are new in TD Snap, um, in particular the Simplified Topics area. So uh, I notice that whenever I read the What's New section in the App Store. So let me close out that and open up TD Snap. This is uh, what I've highly customized and typically use. So to see a new user, I'm going to go into edit mode and tap on user. Okay, so I tapped on user and then I tapped on uh, the one that I'm currently in. I scroll down, tap on new user, get started. I'm going to name this Simplified Topics Update 1. Point two three, just so I know I'm on a fresh one that I haven't done any editing on. And I need symbols, touch, snap core first, United States. I typically use Ella, and I typically use that largest one. So this is a fresh install. So now under topics, this is what you get. So it's not necessarily a bad thing that it's been simplified because it was pretty visually overwhelming. But in particular, I was sad that the my emotions topic didn't make the cut of what to be included here because I used it a lot to help kids uh, learn self-regulation skills. So in order to add that, back, what you need to do first is log into your My Toby Dynavox, go out to Page Set Central, and you need to find this one that I've uploaded, Topic My Emotions, and then you'll tap on Add to My Stuff. Along with that, also add Supports My Emotions and tap Add to My Stuff. So you need to do that first so they'll be available for importing. So then I'm gonna go back over here and I'm going to add a button <clears throat> and I'm gonna title it My Emotions. And I believe that's the symbol that was used before. And here you can, if you want to, tap the little paint bucket and change um, skin tone for that particular button. I'm going to take off the speak and insert. And I'm going to link, import and link to page from my Toby Dynavox. So I have here supports and topics. So I need the topic first, next, and import, done. And then while I'm there, I'm gonna go ahead and change that button color I think that's vanilla, yep. And then done. And then I'm gonna tap on it. And so now that's imported back in, but if you'll see I'm tapping on supports and nothing's there. So I need to go back into edit mode, tap on supports. I need to, I'm gonna remove that one. Link to page import and link to page from my Toby Dynavox, <clears throat> supports my emotions, next, and import, done. And so now when I tap it, there's your visual timer, there's first, talk to France. Then, 
feel better. And these are all editable. Uh, checking in. My emotions. Feeling sad. And then after you do that, let's go back to home. I would always make sure to hit sync. So you sync your changes and that's saved. And then periodically you also need to go through the process of um, uploading or backing up your user area. Anyway, this is just a quick look at what's different about the topics and how you could go about about um, adding those back in. And often I'll also, under style, put a border around it that stands out like that. So that'll be what you end up, up with. Hope this helps.